Hey everyone, so I wanted to do a, a video just to show people what goes into um, live streaming a League of Ireland game and what you need to do in the days building up to it and what goes actually what actually goes on on the night of a, of a game. So I'll try and do a few more of these over the next few weeks and months if I can just to give people an idea of um, what we do as a business and how the business is actually developing. Um, but if you are interested and it's something you'd like to see, maybe subscribe to the channel below and maybe drop a like if you can. Um, it would be much appreciated. Cheers. Enjoy. So basically there's a couple of things we need to do in the build up to a match on the weekend. The first thing we'd probably do is get in touch with the, the club PRO and get any sponsor images or videos or anything that they want to display and get that loaded up to the uh, the streaming software so we can uh, display that in the, the build up to kickoff and at half time. Um, second thing then really what we have to do is get hold of the team lineups or the squad lists and basically that means us loading all these players up onto our software which we use so we'd also be creating team sheets from the night so we get a template off the FBI for the, the team sheet on the night and we also use a software called Guppy, which um, we would use with the streaming software, which uh, would bring up player images for subs coming on and off, red and yellow cards, or and squad lists to, to be displayed as well. So that takes a little bit of time. Um, I'm actually off these, this week. I, do, I usually do this at uh, night time, but uh, as I'm off this week, I'm getting it done during the day, so it's, uh, it's quite handy. Right, so that's everything really ready to go. Um, we have all the sponsor images and videos ready on OBS and we have the squad lists ready to go on Guppy. Um, ideally we get them, maybe we get the team sheets about an hour before kickoff and we modify them. But uh, yeah, as you can see here, everything good to go with Guppy and OBS all good to go. Here at St. Coleman's Park, and um, it's about an hour and 20 minutes to kick off. So, I'll usually get here, get up into the press box, get everything set up as early as possible, and get testing on things like the, the bitrate of the stream and make sure the mics are all good.
so we're going to half an hour kick off. Um, as you can see in the background, all the teams are out. Um, pretty much got everything set up here now, so I'll give you a run through. So, camera's good to go. Laptop is all set up. Mic's all good to go. And team sheets are in. So one thing we kind of have to contend with here on summer evenings is the sun which actually comes right down below the clubhouse down there in the corner. So when we're shooting like this, the camera will be facing right into the sun which makes it really difficult for us. So hopefully tonight will be actually a bit cloudy and we won't get too much sun. So game's over now, finished nil all, um, Cobran was a two men sent off in the end, so they did well to keep it out of the draw. Um, we had a few small, small issues with a bit of buffering during the game, but uh, nothing major, all fixed at half time, just took to adjust the mics and the, the video settings. Um, basically all went really well, just basically now time to clean up here, take everything down and get home. Everyone's petering out here, good crowd here tonight. Um, had about, I think 437 is what they said. Decent game in fairness, um, but um, yeah, nil all draw. Right, so that's everything packed up. Um, now time to go home get something to eat and work on compressing the files that we recorded, sharing them with the, uh, the club and just having a look back over the live stream once that goes up on LOI TV, making sure everything was okay, seeing if there's anything we do a bit better. Um, outside of that, um, every case of uploading the footage to the Club Ramblers Relive It uh, profile which will be announced uh, this week, should be announced by now, um, so great to see them using that. But um, yeah, basically that's it for, for the night. Um, all went really well, I think. Um, fortunately, no goals, so no need to use the replay button or anything like that. So uh, maybe next time we might take a look at that. But um, yeah, everything went well. So basically what I'm doing now is taking the files off the SD card that was in the camera from the stream tonight um, transferring them onto my computer and compressing them. So because we've, we stream in 1080p those files are really really uh, really big so we, the whole game would be about 20 gigs so what we need to do then is compress them down using a, a program called Handbrake and that can get a 4 gig file down to about maybe half a gig uh, with the right settings. So the camera splits them up in, into 5 files tonight so what I'll have is 20 gigs worth of files brought down to about maybe 2.5, 3 gigs all in so it's a, it's a pretty handy thing to use. So once that's finished then it's a case of either sending them onto the club or else uploading them to the club's relive platform so everyone in the club can actually watch that footage and uh, create clips and share them then as well and, and download if they want so um, that's nearly done it's about 5 to 11 so yeah nearly done for the night.
So all the footage you now has been compressed and uploaded to the club's uh, Relive page. So that's me done for the night. It is 20 past 11, so time to relax for a little bit. And that's that. Cheers everyone, bye.